Hey guys, this is Tapper 50 and yeah, your service will start. So, last episode, we took out the chopper, we stole a tuxedo, and we did the tango. But anyways, let's get right into this, shall we? So, at least in this one, uh, let's see what we're going to do. Uh, speaking of bottles, uh, we are going to try to figure out what we're going to do. Uh, I'm assuming it has to be one of these two levels that we haven't been to yet. Um, is I know the vault, for a fact, is in a mission level, I just don't know which. So, if it's not even one of these missions, probably before we do the last mission in this um, episode, uh, I'll make sure we find the vault. But hopefully, that's the case. But anyways, uh, let's make our way... Oh, right, I'm already getting caught. Alright, uh, let's just do the one in the far back. This will just be simple, easy, and I'm not doing the greatest right now. I'm getting like chased by so many people. Alright. Oh. Boom. Ooh, okay. Let's make our way. There we go. Okay. Okay, I'm I'm feeling a little bit happy about this. I think this is the way to Alright, so I think this might be the area we need to get into for that last um fall boom. We're gonna be careful. Murray's rotund features prevent him from fitting through the drain pipe, so we'll need you to unlock the vault room from the inside. I've heard through a reliable source that the guards keep the vault combination written beneath one of their break tables. So you want me to crawl under each till I find it? That's the idea. This is already sounding stupid. Whoa, okay, <laughs> for, secu for security purposes. Why in the world? I don't see any code. Why in the Try world? Table. It's here somewhere. Why in the world would you put a security combination in, like the most view plain sight? Allow no guest entry to the inner workings of the palace. This party right. is supposed to be legitimate. Knocking and him out. Unless he has something. Nope. Alright, um wait a minute. Oh. Okay. That makes it easy. Just have to. No code here. All right. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Just be one of these tables. This table doesn't have the code. I right, asked me the last table then. This is it. Fantastic. Now type the code. In oh the lord. That is what you call some deep pixeled, like. Graphics, holy crap! Oh, it's upside down. All right. Anyways, let's let's pickpocket this garbage. He actually has stuff. And crap, that's what I forgot to do. I forgot to sell things. It's all right. And another gold ring. Fantastic. All right. We'll put in the code and see what we can do now. All right, hold off on that. Let's actually open this up. I'd love to see the look on Rajan's face when he finds this vault empty. The code should be eight five seven. All right, eight five seven. All right, let's see what we get. That's it? You're not going to explain what it does? Alright. Um, I don't really use the combat dodge really that much. I'll probably use it later on, but let's see what this does. Okay. Confuse your enemies into attacking each other with a tap from your cane. Okay. Oh, that that's cool. Okay. that's That's pretty cool. Thanks for breaking us in, pal. The Murray approves. Let's get down to brass tacks. I need to hack both the vault room computers to get control of the electronic winch above the ballroom. So what are me and Sly here for? 
The second I enter their servers, they'll be on to us. You guys need to work together to keep the thugs off my back. You and me, pal, side by side. The Murray knows no fear. Okay, I'm in. Hacking the level six barrier. All right. Oh, and I'm playing as Murray. Let's see what you got. Come on. Wait, do I have like? Oh, wait, I do have an ability. Hold on. Um. Oh, that is one hard hit. Okay. Oh, okay. I can hit my allies. That's not good. All right. Moving on to the level five system. All right. Man, Sly is like kicking so much butt right now. Come on. No. Hoop. Watch out. All right, who's next? Oh. I didn't know he moved. <laughs> oh my god. I thought he was sta I thought you'd say something. Okay. I'm All right, Bentley. You know, you could have just been like, hey, Murray, go into another one. Have fun. Achoo. Keep an eye on you from now on. Nope. Achoo. Achoo. Right, staying near you, Bentley. Come on. Almost there. Got it. Moving on to the level five system. Got you, got you, got you. Come on, I could go all day with this. Watch out. Man, I'm like one punch man. This is amazing. Beautiful. Alright, come on. Whoa. So good. Okay, I'm close. Whoa. Nope. Come on. Man, for bodyguards, you're really bad at this. Nope. Oh, my apologies. Okay, so I guess I could friendly fire Bentley. This ain't good. We could give him health. Okay, going for level three. Uh, I probably should stop the fire. I can't take the risk of failing this again. Oh, okay. Oh. Right, anyone with the fire sticks, I'm not taking a chance with. Yes, headed for level two. Whoop! Boom! Come on! Whoop! Ooh, man, I'm doing good right now. Come on. The Murray has got this. Alright. No. Nope. Boom. Feel the fire. Head back to him, head to back to him. Come on. Oh, okay. Guess what? Whoop boom. I'm unstoppable. I've got control of the winch. Thanks for the backup, guys. No problem. Me and the big guy had it covered. Murray, let's hook up the direct feed and get out of here while the coast is clear. <laughs> oh my God, my. I was, ooh, my blood was going crazy. All right, so now what? Can I like go out this way or do I just jump? Oh. Okay, so I just, okay, I guess I go back the way I came. Okay, I thought I was gonna exit out here, okay. All right, well, I got the Insanity Strike, but it was kind of cool that it was showing the Insanity Strike in, uh, 
the cutscene. That was kind of interesting. So we'll, we'll use that when we need more allies. All right. Um, but first order business. We still got to do two more. This might be a little bit longer episode than I anticipate because I do want to try to squeeze in as much as I can. All right. Uh, that one is Bentley. So we'll do Bentley next. All right. Hoop. Hoop. All right. Come on, Sly. And there we go. Perfect. And we can start selling stuff, too. So we might have caught up on our upgrades. All right. Let's see here. Yes, we did. Okay, so we bought everything for everyone right now. Perfect. All right. Plays Bentley. Uh, double check on Bentley. Uh, sized stabilizer. Um, shrink guards by what? Okay, so that'll work. I'll keep that in mind. So I guess when we shrink them, they're like one shot. Let's actually test it, actually. Yeah, they're basically one shots. So that's cool. Okay. That in mind. Uh, at the guest house. Okay, so let's keep them moving. Did you fall asleep. Boof. Up. Oh. Okay, well, how the heck am I supposed to get up there? Okay, let's see here. Oh, perfect. Bentley, what's your status? I'm in position with the RC chopper. All systems are go to neutralize their surface-to-air defenses. We're going to need free reign of the sky during the heist. Well, be careful. Chopper parts aren't cheap. Hostile has been sighted. Hey, Bentley, use the left analog stick to steer the chopper and hit the X button to drop bombs. If you lose track of the Jeep, I'll project a holographic targeting arrow. Follow it back into the action. All right, this is going to be interesting. Launch your missiles. Try hard to dodge them. Oh. It's so hard to keep track of where this thing Oh! Oh lord, alright. Perfect. Wait, that was it? That was only like one minute! What? <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with it. Wait, what was my other ability again? Okay, trigger bomb. Okay, cool. Alright, well, we'll head back to get Sly. Okay. And then we'll wrap up this episode. Okay. I'm perfectly fine with that. I was actually kind of surprised it went that quickly. Guess I'm good with RC helicopters. Even though I never... F I actually, no. Uh, to be fair... Flew like a toy helicopter, and then my and then my high school senior flew a drone. So I, I could at least say I had some experience. It'd be nice to have a drone. I would love to do like aerial footage. Um, I think I had a lot of fun with it. Uh, mostly it was like beaches or something like that. That'd be like amazing. Because I guarantee you those people that like do those type of aerial footage gets like paid like so much. But anyways, that's just another time for another day. Anyways, uh, let's uh, go over here. Oh, crap. Oh, okay, hold. Boom. And elephant disappeared. We need to find a way to get Rajan's prize elephants out of their pen. I don't know, Bentley. That door looks pretty heavy. Maybe I can crawl on that hole under the steps and find an alternate route. All right, let's see here. Oh, 
Okay, that's good. All right, cool. All I had to do is walk in there, then he started freaking out. Wow, you sure look spooked. A job well done, Sly. Now comes the hard part. I need you to snatch the headdress jewels worn by both elephants. The jewels are firmly embedded, so keep whacking at them with your cane to knock one loose. I'll need to make use of the rooftops to get to one of the elephants' backs, but it shouldn't be a problem. Alright, um... Question mark. Can I get up there? Alright, need something to get me across. Alright, help. Elephant, you're my- oh, nope, okay. Nope, oh, oh, lord, okay. Oh wait, there's one. Oh lord. Alright. Alright, got one. Hopefully it does not make me fall off. And it did. Crap. Nope. Ah. Don't need to fail this mission. Come on. Alright, come on. Oh, Lord. Okay, this elephant's getting aggressive. Oh, Lord. Alright. Alright, I need to get some health. Come on, health. Else. Okay, thank you. Alright, where did it go? Is that the elephant that has... No, that's the elephant. Alright, that's not the one I'm looking for. That's the one I'm looking for. Alright. Why does it not let me jump properly? Come on. Speed up, speed up, speed up, and all right. Ooh. Nope. Man, this elephant's like freaking out. Like, holy crap. Dang it. Run ahead, run ahead. There we go, somewhat. Nope. No! Elephant! Elephant, why? Oh no. Back off. <sighs> Come on. Alright. My camera angle. Oh lord. All right, got it. Now I need some major health right now. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, guard, on guard, on guard, on guard. I grab that. Oh, Lord. All right. All right, well, that was easy. Okay, taking deep breaths right now. Come on. Elephant, here, I'll give you some, like, uh, peanuts. You know, exchange that for that crown of yours. All right, got that. And let me get back on one more time. Come on. Oh, Lord. All right, that's not the right way. Nope, that's not it. Oh! Oh! What? Oh! Wait, what? What? 
What was that? <laughs> what was that? Look, did anyone see that? I'm sorry, I'll have to interrupt this cutscene. What was that? <laughs> like, I grabbed it, but then I phased through the world. Oh my god, I can't, I'm so glad I got that on camera. Okay, synchronize your watches. This heist is going to take extreme precision. Here's the plan. I'll start things off by demolishing the palace's main bridge. That should cut off reinforcements from the guest house and hopefully distract the ballroom guard standing watch over the clockwork wings. Sly will then take Carmelita up on her offer for a dance, and while the crowd is transfixed by their tango, Murray will lower into the ballroom on the electronic winch. Once down, he'll cut the wings free and then winch back up for an exit. Murray should then make his way out of the palace. I'll cover his exit with the RC chopper. Once he's past the drawbridge, we're home free. Of course we are. Okay, but either way, oh my god, that was really funny. Oh my lord. All right, let's just see if we have any sell, sell any loot. No, we don't. All right, uh, we're going to end this episode off. This is Time Out 50, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.